In our world, the industrial world, the life cycle continues. As we know, these plants today, they're always moving, always changing every single day. And trying to keep up with it is a challenge. But it all starts with laser scanning. It captures it, it time stamps it, uh, and it's been being documented. You have much more fidelity. You have much more depth in what you capture, regardless of it's food and bath, oil and gas, automotive, shipbuilding, pulp and paper. It has applicability in all of those. I'll give you a couple examples. In the automotive industry, they're using 3D laser scanning to understand retooling of lines to facilitate and move automobiles and parts through the factory faster. In food and bev industry, they're using it to understand relocation. If we have to put in, oh, a new conveyor, a new line, with 3D laser scanning, you can do that without having to shut down the line. We can use predictive analysis to understand what we're going through. I mean, with laser scanning, the idea is, is you want to capture one time and one time only, and it's, it's your first ROI out of the gate is you're saving the revisits to your project. Many times in the past, myself, when I was in engineering, had to send myself or our crews back and forth to the site. Did we get enough information? Something can be easily missed, whether it's not enough measurements or the scope of the project may change too, and which happens quite often. With 3D laser scanning, not only are you capturing everything in your environment and making it measurable, you actually have full fidelity, you have 3D imagery, just like a CAD model, but it is real world. In a CAD model, all pipes are orthogonal, but in the real world, in the plant, I bet you cannot find an orthogonal pipe. There's gonna be sags, you're gonna need supports, shoes. You not only look at it from a one direction, you can move around the tank 360 degrees. You can look above the tank, below the tank. You can get every aspect of that tank to make a very informed and intelligent decision. If the customer has a design that they would like to use that and see, does this interfere out in the real world? Rather than spending all the time out in the field, try to field fit things because that can become very, very costly. Yeah, in, in typical measurements, there are things that you don't necessarily captured. So in a tank, for example, a tank can have a dent. You really don't see that, but in 3D laser scanning, you can capture that information. You can look at verticality. You can look at plumbness and roundness of a tank. You can also do meshing to capture volume metrics. You can also look at space environment. You can look at installations and you can do conceptual drawings and details using this technology. Within Leica Geosystems, we have built software that allows it to be very easy and simple for you to use your existing CAD tools in conjunction with point clouds. With CloudWorks, you are able to open point clouds within your existing CAD tool, allowing you to get to a deliverable much faster. In our world, we really want clean data, things off of uh, stainless steel, like in this environment here. Uh, stainless steel has always been a nemesis of laser scanning. And so you always get that reflectivity, even on the other side of the spectrum, with anything that is black in color. It just, like as always, absorbs the laser. It's just tough to get data off of that. So we get a really good return off that. So the RTC 360 does a phenomenal job, the very clean data. Uh, we get a half a millimeter noise out at 50 meters, and uh, getting clean data off stainless steel is phenomenal. So one of the great things about the RTC 360 laser scanner is this ease of use. What makes that compelling is that you do not need to hire extra crews. It's just another tool in the toolbox of someone at your office or at your facility. It's very simple. You take the scanner, you go out, you push the button, you capture data. This is something that Leica Geosystem has built into the technology. We have made it easy to use. But one of the great things about 3D laser scanning is reducing downtime. Less time in the facility equals safety. The less time you have a subcontractor or even an employee in a hazardous area, the better it is for OSHA, for your safety record, for that individual. Speed gets you in and out very quickly. Well, nowadays with the technology that we have, even the onboard pre-registration tools with the Viz, it's amazing the amount of time that is saved. So uh, it's all about a faster workflow in the field and even in the process now and uh, with the ability to share this data 
through the cloud for QA, QC checks it may be, or other final deliverables. In today's very competitive industrial plant, we really need solutions that allow us to give very quick and very accurate decisions. This allows us to respond quicker and to reduce downtime and mitigate risk. It has tools that you can use in the field that's valuable when you get back in the office. For example, you can take your iPad, go out and take a picture of a key area. If there's a valve, if there's a pump that's of value, you can literally take a picture of that valve, pump, or whatever that piece of equipment may be, and it is instantly tied to your point cloud. It might be that your uh, management might need it for asset management. Uh, you can take this and you can create fly-throughs. You can add hyperlinks to what we call geotags. They're basically placeholders that have information. Now that I can virtually walk through my facility, I'll be able to click on, on uh, maybe a geotag, which is a placeholder, and it'll pull up a live operations report. It could be uh, an inspection report. It could be a photograph of a certain valve or a pump that maybe reflect to the manufacturers. Anything is at my fingertips. What about shutting down a bypass? You can use laser scanning to show where it is in the facility and then videotape it with your iPad and tie it to your point cloud. Now anyone anywhere that you give access to can now view that data. No one has to come into your plant. They can sit remotely and key in to your actual facility. A lot of our customers, they have plants located all around the world, whether they're stateside or not. <clears throat> and logistically, just to plan and to get around and try to get things, it's all about timing. But now they can virtually visit the di their digital twin, is what we call it. It's physically taking their facility and bringing it to them, to their fingertips at their desktop. There's no more efficient way to get data into your digital twin than through laser scanning.